welcome to my studio. I'm going to give you a quick update of what I've done. I've actually cleaned and organized. It's been months since I've done that. Months and months and months since I've actually cleaned and organized and put everything in its place. I even forgot some of the things that I had piled up in places. So, hold on a sec. I'm going to get up and give you a tour around and give you some tips on how you can organize your craft room to make things better for yourself. Oh, so I just thought of something. Whenever you're, everybody has a brother, P-Touch, label maker, right? Or some sort of label maker. This will make your life so much easier. You will see when I get going. My sister gave me these for Christmas. Aren't they lovely? Okay, let me go around and, and get the camera. Okay, so now we're looking around in my studio. This is where facing, this is what I face. And here I have a bookshelf with all my car colored card stocks. And in that pink binder, I'm going to go slow and hopefully not freak y'all out in this pink binder are my stencils. My sister gave me another scrapbook that you can put pictures in. It's really lovely. I haven't done anything with it. All of my stamps and dies are organized and filed right here. Everything, everything. I have embossing folders and I also have some books that I started making, some art journals that I'm gonna make some more. These are all my envelopes and extra card stuff, then vellum paper that I have. Just lightweight colored card stuff is right in here. Okay, this is my table. That This is my pile of things that I still need to address, but I'm still thinking of where I'm gonna put it. I have these little caddies that hold things. My sewing machine. We never throw anything away in our family. Look at how old the screwdriver is. Look at this handle. Yeah, never. Never, never, never. Okay, so this is one of, I got this, these two Ikea chest of drawers. And this holds, as you can see, look, I got, my, I got it labeled. Stick it, Yupo, Bristol, watercolor card, envelopes. If you open it up, that's what's in there. And there's some vellum too, I put in there. And this stuff my sister gave me for Christmas. Six by six card stocks. Embossing powders. Hot press watercolor and the little spoons extra 12 by 12 solid cardstock and these interesting little papers. And then we have cold press watercolor 12 by 12 cardstock, so it's just kind of crumpled. Nina, Desert Storm, cardstock. And then we have Nina, Solar White, 80 pound. Let me put it to you like this. And then Nina, Solar White, 80 pound and 110 pound. And then this is 110 pound down at the bottom. And I have some already cut both, both ways for when I want to use it. In my mom's crystal cabinet, she has all kinds of crystal in here. At the bottom, I cleaned it out and I have storage for stuff for my uh, paper making supplies and uh, I have some, this is like plastic string and this is my blender for making paper. All kinds of good stuff. So 
uh, I'm gonna keep that and that's my extra craft paper big piece of just paper hmm. okay I finally cleaned it off people yes I did and I made me a Dr. Who, Dr. Seuss who will who orange flower arrangement to go on top of my big shot oh Franny just came in okay every one of my drawers oh she's <laughs> she climbed on my back every one of my drawers in my row my lovely row of six of these Ikea cabinets with chest of drawers which I absolutely adore has a sticker on it labeling what's in the drawer so for this one prima watercolor koi gansai tambai watercolor and it's got gouache too because i just put that in there this morning see that's what's in it so i can oh now this is little this one is on wheels and this contains everything i use on the fly while I'm working. I'm going to show you perspective from sitting on my desk, at my desk. This is what I see. Got to have my coffee cup. It's bananas. B-A-N-A-N-A-S. My heat, heat tool. I got a Leatherman for Christmas for myself. If you don't know what a Leatherman is, it's one of those multi-tools that can do everything. I'm trying to open it while I'm showing you other stuff. See, it's, it has everything, like 28 million tools in one. Uh, my plants are thriving. My little vacuum cleaner. Uh, this is old card stocks and scraps to make paper. I found my flamingos, my, my little box of flamingos. This is just quick ephemera to use up. Didn't fit anywhere else. I have two, my little mini, one mini Misty, my regular Misty, and my Tim Holtz one. Swing line cutter, Tim Holtz tonic cutter. Scorer, but I also have the Friskers thing to score stuff. An envelope maker. I have the ephemera I made w the other day with my jelly jelly print. And these now I have projects lined up. My tile projects project that I'm going to work on to make the flamingo. Uh, the flamingo mosaics. These are all my pens and pencils, watercolor pencils, regular pen, uh, colored pencils, my Copic markers. Uh, we have distress markers, Sharpies and Sharpies. I have Spectrum Aqua markers. I have Posca markers in various colors right there. This I have, I didn't even open it yet. Uniball, Signo gel ink pens. What, uh, it's white, silver, and gold. And then the souffle. I got some souffles I haven't even opened yet. Of course, of course, of course. And I have these, which are lovely. Uh, Zig calligraphy in various colors. I have, of course, my Wink of Stella and other such as that. And these are my Tombow's watercolor pins. I have 
Zig Clean color, real brush, pens, you name it, I got it, babe. I have Distress Colored Crayons. This, these are all of my uh, Neo Color 2 watercolor crayons. I love these. I love playing with them and doing all different kinds of things with them. They're fun, 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 fun. I love water media stuff, you know, and I have a pack right here to take on the go. But, you know, it, I just have everything here. So this is like, I have projects that I've been working on for a while. Um, see, right here. They've been started. We got them started, not finished. Uh, I had a rough year last year. See, this is starting. I got some done here, but I need to work on them more. You see, I have my, my list of things to do. And uh, I want to work on some clipboards and doing art on these clipboards. I could probably, ooh, I can't take that off. So, and then this is my computer desk, which is with total chaos here. Yeah. But it's it's controlled chaos because I know where everything is. And if I do this, you're going to see oh, Lady Gaga and Joycey. We don't have them anymore. Lady Gaga died of a pneumonia and Joycey got taken away by raccoons. We had a raccoon problem. It was very sad. I loved my Joycey. So anyway... Let me do that. Uh, uh, label your drawers. That's all I gotta say. Is put label. Use your use your label maker. You have it. Use it. Put the label on the outside of your drawers. It looks fine. I mean, and that this is your space. If you don't. If you don't label your drawers, you're going to forget what you have in them. You're going to spend so much time opening different drawers trying to find exactly what it is you want. When you can just go, oh, I want this. Do a quick scan. Grab. Open the drawer that you need. Grab and go. And also, looking at all the, the words, you might realize ah, that might be a better tool to use. So that's my suggestion. I hope you enjoyed your little my little tour of my updated neat, spring clean organized studio. I am so glad I finally got my act together. I you know because last year last year was rough. Um, divorce, thyroid surgery, <sighs> two biggies major surgery and a divorce but I pulled through it just fine and I'm in a happier place for it and uh, I can I can create beautiful things again which I'm ready to do so I'm about to start on another project as soon as I get this video working on that computer which is old I have it I've had it since 2010 and it still works really well if you take good care of your things it will happen. You can use them for a very long time. Anyway, it's been a pleasure showing you my, around my crazy room. Yes, I am drinking coffee. It's bananas. And I always remember, life is short. Have some fun. Love you. Mean it. Bye. How to turn this thing off.